guys, Game of Matsu here, and welcome back to some more. Like we need just to the adventure continues, and I hate everything because, hey, why not? Why doesn't? Why won't we? Why don't we just screw with Game of Matsu 13's head for a day and not decide to and decide to have Game Capture HD crash right after you just freaking recorded a video that you can't re-record? So now I have to skip the entire tutorial section of how to access the level. God. Basically, so yeah, this, this is a re-record because Game Capture HD hates me, hates my life, and hates everything about me. So basically, I'm just gonna have to try and re-explain -ex everything the best I can. <laughs> Do the hot rod race, win the hot rod race, yada yada yada. I don't need to explain to you guys how to win the hot rod race. It's pretty straightforward. Just set line, follow it. And you'll be fine. Now, when you complete the race, you will have access to Stanford and Greasy. I bought both of them because I have the money. You'll use Stanford's hieroglyphic ability to solve the puzzle. And then you can enter the level. Now I have to explain this to you guys again. So, basically, the uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to... Um, Kill all three of these guys, and then we're gonna take the rocket launcher right here. Go up the fan, switch to Andy's whip, and then we can whip swing then we can whip swing across. Now we can push this crate over here, which will let Stanford up because now we have a step for him to use. I'm trying to beat my time from last time, in case you guys didn't notice. Now we can get both of them up here and stand on both of the buttons. Then get when Indy's whip in hand, and get ready to kick some serious butt. Okay, now the only thing we need, really need up here is this water bottle. Because we need this to extinguish the fire. Parkour. Put out the flames. Pull the switch. You can punch them, punch them. Punch this guy. Switch to the whip. Go like that. And then he drops his sword. Guess what we can use the sword for? Remember that rope that we saw in the beginning? We jump down here, then we can toss the sword at the rope, thus opening the gate forward. Now we can just go around. Assuming you still have the rocket launcher, you can shoot the, you can shoot the crates, allowing you to use your whip on the orange handle. Then you can jump across. Oh, also the true adventure for this level is 15,000 studs. And new best time, minute and 34 seconds that bad so that was it that's actually going to do for this episode so thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed if you did be sure to support the video with slam that like button leave a comment telling us what you thought and if you're on to my videos if you really enjoyed be sure to hit the subscribe button it helps out a lot and until next time this has been a game that's your scene signing off saying hope you have a good day and i'll catch you guys tomorrow for some more like when you don't the adventure continues goodbye then drop dead comrade complete all treasure mode levels in skull one hub okay so let's review hmm uh, I'm one minute and 25 seconds in. Bubble well, this interesting. shouldn't take long at all to render. It'll turn. So, what we want to do is we want to get it... Out there. So, because there's going to be a sock there.